Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to update your profile at Biggest Talent and also upload your video. Uh, before you get started, one thing you might want to try to do in advance is create a folder on your desktop and in there you can uh, put a little um, notepad uh, or a WordPad file in there that has your pernum on it. Uh, your master pin you want to make sure that you have everything uh, prepared so when you log in you're ready uh, the name of your video and also a copy of your video in there so you have easy access to it when you go to upload so what I'm going to do is scroll down to the bottom uh, it says join and get started click on that now you have two places where you can check the frequently asked questions. One of them is on the menu bar up on the top. You have your frequently asked questions there. And then down at the bottom of the page about us. FAQs, terms of use, privacy policy. Uh, one thing you want to note in the FAQs is that we increased um, the size and length of the allowed video. Uh, it was increased to four minutes and 700 megabytes and if you scroll down on the FAQs it will tell you what video formats are allowed and also we extended the deadline uh, we added some more prizes so you want to check that out too uh, more prizes for uh, uh, the winners of the um, the, the regional um, competitions and then also uh, for those who invited uh, the the talents so you want to check all that out too so we're going to assume that you have already created an account if not there is a separate video on how to register so we're going to go to login that's a little uh, icon in the top right corner click on login and you will enter um, the three random position numbers from your your six number master pin so you want the fifth number in your master pin the sixth number of your master pin and the third number of your master pin now you can either use the keypad or you can use your keyboard And once we get logged in, uh, you'll see that I have started a little bit on uh, the profile. Now, this is a, a bogus account. This, this is not real. Um, if you don't, if you registered as a uh, competitor, you do need to make sure that your profile is complete and that you have a profile picture. Uh, and you must do that before you, it will even allow you to update your uh upload your video and uh, if you're not going to be a competitor then you want to click here and go back and change your status to judge so we're going to go to my account first now I have some information in here already now previously right here uh, my uh, master pin or not master pin but the uh, pernum which is uh, 
your personal number. That's your uh, permanent account number, basically. That was here, so I changed the name. And uh, actually, I can change this to Kendra. And uh, I've listed as a contestant. Your birth date, uh, your country, state or province, your city, your zip code. And then also it's a good idea to write up uh, just a little welcome message for your fans and those who will be uh, looking over your profile and voting on you. Just type that in there. And we need to add a photo. So I already had a photo placed in the uh, desktop folder so it was easy to access so uh, you add that find your photo and then click on save changes and then it'll show your profile picture next thing you want to do is go to my video and again it gives you a little bit more information on what's allowed what's not allowed uh, for all practical purposes, uh, this year we would uh, we are asking that everybody create a video specifically for the competition. Uh, we don't want somebody who is uh, bringing in videos that are five, ten years old, um, and that is the reason for adding an introduction. So on your video, you should have uh, know, thirty seconds or less little introduction. I'm just going to give you a little example here. Hello. My name is Kendra from Minnesota in the United States. Please support me at Biggest Talent. That's about all you have to do. Okay, you have two ways to import your video. You can uh, import a new video from uh, YouTube, Vube, Yuku. You enter the video URL and click Grab Video. And it gives you a little example here of which YouTube uh, link to, to uh, add. Make sure that you uh, click on the correct link in YouTube. And uh, when you're adding your um, the URL, make sure that you don't have it set on uh, autoplay or, uh, you know, so that if you have a bunch of uh, other videos that aren't even yours or or there might be another video uh that's that's going to play next turn the autoplay off because that's uh sometimes uh coded into the url and it might not work right so we're going to go back to my video i'm going to click on upload now i uh, entered a video in that folder that i put on uh, desktop and we want the title of the song or the video. And this one is going to be uh, Cherry Flowers Music. Description is music from the Cherry Flowers group. category this is going to be a band now if you're in a band or a group you click that if you're a dancer or in a dance group you click on that if you are just a um, solo artist instrumentalist uh, you just play uh, uh, one uh, one uh, musical instrument or if you are uh, a singer or in a singing group so we are going to do band, date recorded, let's see, this is the day of the month, so today's the 6th, let's say we did this a couple days ago, 2018, location recorded, uh, And again, this is this is just a bogus uh, 
video that I made up. I, I uh, grabbed a, a video f uh, with Creative Commons from uh, uh, YouTube. Now there was no singers in this band, but uh, Kendra is one of the uh, three uh, dancers. Or backup singers, whatever you want to call them. Formal song title is Cherry Flowers Music. Now you have um, different ways to handle the comments that will be coming from your viewers. Um, the more interaction that you have with your your videos and your account, the better off for you. Um, if, if you are um, interacting with your fans and those who are watching your videos and uh, you know you're expecting them to vote on you the more you communicate with them the better off you are going to be so the best thing is to add comments without approval if you do get uh, you know you get people who are just coming in and um, being malicious of course and we hope that there is none of that we have never had a problem with that in the past uh, you can come back in and uh, I assume you can edit this but add comments without approval is the best and then you don't have to come in and check it all the time uh, to approve them and then uh, voting on the comments uh, it's a good idea to allow users to vote on the comments that again gives uh, more interaction so we're going to go we're going to upload the video I'm going to browse and again this is that folder that I put on my desktop uh, this is the video I created and we're going to upload that click on upload video after you selected it now this may take a while and you can see the progress here status uh, it's, it's best not to do anything else while this is uploading uh, just let it uh, let it run until it uploads and uh, right now I am going to pause this while it's uploading Okay, that didn't take too long. Uh, the video has completed. Now it gives you a um, URL to share this with. Uh, once the competitions begin, you want to be sure to share this, uh, you know, with friends, family, on your uh, social um, social media accounts, and encourage people to come and uh, join you. Um, if they are not already a, members, a member of any of our uh, sites, they will be able to register. And again, there is a separate uh, uh, video I created uh, with a registration tutorial. So be sure to share that. Now you want, you want people to come in and uh, vote on your video. Listen to your video and vote. There's also an embed code that you can enter uh, on a, a website, a blog that you have. So I'm going to go to go to my video and there it is. Now it's going to take a little while again to convert once it's uploaded. So you want to uh, come back and check that. I'm just going to click on this again to see if it made a difference. Okay, this is going to take a while. It may take, uh, oh, I don't know, five, ten minutes maybe, maybe less. So I'm just going to pause this again and then uh, come back when it's done. Okay, we're back. That took less than five minutes to um, convert once it was uploaded. Now, if you hover over the uh, 
screen placard here. It uh, just gives you a couple of little uh, preview shots. So you can uh, click on that and uh, play your video here. You can uh, click to edit it. Um, just please note, uh, if you do remove your video, if we're already in the competitions, um, you will lose all your votes. So uh, once you're sure that you have uh, uh, the video up there that you want, you uh, make sure that you don't uh, don't change it. Uh, you can choose your thumbnail. We're going to choose that one instead, uh, instead of the blue screen. Again, you can uh, edit the, the information on your video. And we're going to uh, update. And then we are going to go return to my video. All right, so there's the new... Uh, New thumbnail showing okay I'm going to uh, play just give you a little uh, example of what this looks like hello my name is Kendra from Minnesota in the United States please support me at biggest talent Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we proudly present the one, the only, the one and only Project System 12 with the number one hit to share flowers from Hanover, Pennsylvania. Okay, guys, let's hear the music. All right, that gives you a little sampler. Um, from your previous screen, though, you can uh, you can pin your video, tweet, uh, Google Plus. Uh, people who visit your page can uh, comment on your video, uh, leave you a little uh, comment. Uh, we're going to copy this URL and we're going to put it into a new window. And this is what uh, somebody will see once they uh, click on that. Of course, you're logged in, so you're going to see your information. But again, you can uh, you can embed this. You can uh, share your link with others. Uh, you want to encourage people to come to your profile and uh, visit you, vote on your video, and uh, communicate with you. Uh, one thing you don't want to do, and this is what uh, many people do, is they use the contest and they encourage people to go to their outside sites, uh, their YouTube video, their... Um, it's fine to, uh, you know, uh, uh, ask somebody to come and visit your Facebook page, but uh, uh, the idea is to get them to come here to vote for you to support you so that you get more votes so that you win so you want to do your uh, communicating inside the biggest talent and uh, interact with your with your viewers I can go back to my profile and there again is your video uh, now note this one uh, this video is uh, three minutes and 54 seconds so it's under the four minutes and 
I am going to check over. You can't see it because uh, it's not being recorded. But I'm checking in my folder, and uh, this is an MP4 file. Now, the size of this was 129 megabytes. So it's uh, well under the uh, 700 megabytes. Okay, well, I hope that helped. Uh, again, um, I want to welcome everyone to Biggest Talent, all of our uh, competitors this year. We've had uh, oh, many great artists uh, just starting out who have been uh, given a lot of recognition just from uh, competing in our, our uh, competitions. This is our fourth year. Uh, we started off as uh, I Want to Be Famous. Uh, in the About Us, you can read why we changed our name. And uh, I really look forward to seeing uh, all of your, your videos, whether you're a singer, a dancer, a group, uh, uh, instrumentalist. Uh, welcome to uh, Biggest Talent. Have fun and good luck.